Now it's better. Maybe even more, but we will check them later when the core is here than we see. Because they have a very loud voice. Okay, so, I mean, we, we can be, we can try to reconnect back again something like, uh, I don't know, at, at four, so at six. Secondo me sono ancora bassi. I think the first thing to say is that the, the Cappella Marciana, the choir of St. Mark's Basilica, is very honoured and grateful to be taking part in this um, special event. Um, it's been uh, a real pleasure to perform, um, to share this platform with the Hover Choir. They're a wonderful choir and I'm very happy to be conducting them, albeit um, through this, um, this particular um, technology which, which allows this. Um, it was a little difficult to get used to at first because, the, because we are such a great distance away from, from Yerevan here in Venice that there is a slight delay. Um, but in the piece we're doing where we are two choirs, it's a piece by Giovanni Croce for, um, called Ecepanis. And in this piece, um, the Hover Choir sings the second choir and the Cappella Marciana sings the first choir. This is a piece that we sing at St. Mark's from the two organ lofts where we are 14 meters um, distant. In this case, we are thousands of kilometers distant from each other, which makes it um, a very interesting experience. Um, and there is a delay, but we can, um, it's not um, too great that we can't make the piece function and make music. This is a very beautiful piece. Um, and I like to think that in having us singing here and the uh, Hover Choir singing in Yerevan, it's almost as if we are in the Basilica of the world and we are creating this musical bridge from one city to the other. And I think um, it's, it's, we are in dialogue with each other as we, as we sing together and then they sing and we sing and then we come together at the end. And I think bridges of this kind are what we really need in the world nowadays.